Sunday morning and ideal conditions greeted the players at Euphoria Golf Club, hot and sunny with just the gentlest of breezes. Leading the way on 16 under par was Jacques Kreuzvik, the South African getting his final round underway at 10.49 local time. It was, however, his playing partner and defending champion, JC Ritchie, who made the brightest start. This ferocious five wood to the third set up a straightforward two putt birdie. Combined with a Kreuzvik bogey one hole earlier and the overnight deficit was gone. Two holes later and top spot would be his alone. A wayward tee shot left him a tricky approach, but you wouldn't know by watching this. Green found with a plomb. And the ensuing putt no problem. Heading the European charge for most of the day was Jens Dantorp. The Swede closed his account on 11 under par. England's Ross McGowan, however, went one better. The latter finishing on 12 under and in sixth place alone. But in truth, the day always looks set to belong to the host nation. Among their number, Henny Duplessis, the local boy seen here at the ninth. Mounting the strongest challenge to Ritchie, though, was compatriot Wilco Ninava. The youngster delivering some fireworks here with a hole-out eagle at the par 4 8th. He briefly tied the lead himself with this short birdie putt at the 12th, but his rival, Ritchie, showed great composure. Having birdied the 13th and saved par here at the 14th, he'd go on to make another gain at the 16th. It all meant that he'd head down the final fairway with a two-stroke lead. No problem finding the heart of the green, and two putts later, JC Ritchie confirmed himself Limpopo champion for the second straight year. Jacques Kreuzer could only muster a final round of plus two, slipping down into a disappointing share of third place. A great week for the youngster Ninaba, but it's JC Ritchie who claims the Challenge Tour season opener.